Welcome again. In previous tutorial, we have seen image upload in CAD PHP. In this tutorial, we'll create folder if it does not exist. Uh, example, we have created a target path in here. You can see that this is the web root and this is the image folder. I already have existing folder in here in my web root directory. This is the web root directory and this is the image folder that we are seeing in here. So now if you want to create a new folder into this image folder, then uh, this folder uh, you have to create manually or you can create it programmatically. So let's uh, let uh, write some code in here to create a uh, new folder if it does not exist. Uh, so I'm going in catfish documentation. In this documentation, you can see in left side, in their utility classes, there is a folder and file option. If you go and click on this, you can see that this is the, this is the class for create new folder. But problem is, uh, you can see that they, are, they have given a message in here that this class uh, has deprecated. So now it is time to use simple uh, PHP make directory uh, function and it's very simple uh, you have to just uh, need to write in here for example uh, make directory and there is the four parameters I think uh, yeah the first parameter is mandatory and all are the options uh, optional so first let's create a directory uh, in our into our image directory and I'm giving here a uh, directory separator and concatenate I'm giving the name of my folder that I wanted to create into the image directory so um, uh, assumption that uh, I'm creating the user image folder in image directory so when you write your this code uh, it will create your uh, new directory when you will run this script so if you're using Linux then you can uh, add the mode in here if you don't give the mode then by default it will be 0777 uh, so you can use it or you can use your uh, um, access folder access mode uh, 0775 like that so uh, so when you will run code then it will create your folder but uh, after create the folder when you will run this code again then it will again try to create folder so we have to prevent this using a simple condition we are giving a simple condition called if is directory then is directory a another function in php so you can see use this if this directory if this if there has this directory uh, then it will not execute but if there is no directory that means if not directory not getting this directory then it will create new directory okay so next thing that we have to do we have to mention it in here so i mean i'm in here so i'm just giving the uh, user image directory mentioning the user image directory in our target path and concatenate in here and using the ds that means directory separator and concatenate again and that name same thing uh, we have to uh, send this name um, if you want to mention our folder on uh, name uh, or want to save our folder name in our database with name then you can give it in here that called user image and then concatenate a backslash in here and concatenate in here and then after save uh, if everything is good then we can go in our uh, in users add directory and here you can see that there is no any folder uh, in in my image directory and so I'm just going to create upload a new image in here or new going to add a new user uh, in here so let's go so I'm just creating a new user called test123 and giving the email address uh, and the password and uploading a image uh, like that and then save so you can see it has saved now in here you can see in my directory a image directory has been created called user image and this is the image that we are seeing so now uh, you can see this image also in here uh, but uh, let's see in our image directory this is the user image yes 
So you can see the image directory also in here. You are also seeing this image in here. So if you database, if you will check in new database, you can see the user image, this uh, folder name added before the image name. So this is the, this is the tutorial. Uh, welcome for the next tutorial.